Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today we're going to be talking about a few of my favourites from this last month. Um, the look I have on my face, um, the video should be up for that now, so if it is I'll link it in the description box below so you can go ahead and watch that if you want. Um, so let's get into this. Um, I have a few skincare and makeup uh, favourites. So first I wanted to show this one. This is the Revolution Skincare London. It is the 10% niacinamide and 1% zinc blemish and pore refining serum. This is, I think, amazing. I have noticed a huge difference in the size of my pores um, and I think it's really helped with uh, general blemishes, even a little bit with my acne. So this is really nice. I just pop it on. I pop like three drops, one on my forehead, one on each cheek and just like rub it in. I put that on before my moisturiser morning and night and I'm really enjoying it. Really, really enjoying it. Oh, crikey. Um, the next thing I wanted to mention is this uh, Dr. Botanicals PO. It's Pomegranate Superfood Regenerating Sleeping Mask. And I just pop this on at night once a week um, after the niacinamide um, serum and uh, I wake up with a really soft skin I I do definitely notice a difference on the mornings that I wake up after using this um, so yeah I really enjoy it I don't I couldn't tell you what else it does other than my skin feels nice in the morning but that to me is something so there is that um, next on my skincare list for favourites is from Lecura. It's a uh, 100% naturally derived eye cream enriched with shea butter and coconut oil. And I got this from Aldi and uh, I really really enjoy this. I, I've definitely noticed a difference in how just in the texture under my eyes and around my eye area I'm um, using this. I use this as my day um, eye cream so I use an oil at night um, but I'm really really enjoying this and uh, hoping I can get hold of some more because uh, this is a staple at the moment really really enjoying that one uh, next on the list is from Simple it's their soothing facial toner it's 100% alcohol free kind of skin um, I think this leaves a really nice um i just feel like it kind of tightens up the pores and it just feels really comfortable on the face i really enjoy it um i've tried a few other toners higher end um other kind of drugstore brands but this ha has to be my favorite i really like it it just feels really nice it's really soothing when you put it on um again i use this morning and night um, just after cleansing. So, what have we next? <laughs> so, now we're on to the more makeup y things. Um, I have this Barry M. It's the Pixie Skin Blurring Beauty Elixir. It's the primer. Um, I believe it's a pretty good dupe of the Fasali one, um, but I don't know. I've never tried that. Um, I do, however, know that. I love this. This leaves such a smooth base for foundation. But I've also, on days when I've not worn foundation, worn this and I do think it has a really nice blurring effect. Um, it's just really nice. It feels really nice. Um, I do think it helps my makeup last longer. Um, so yeah, another new favourite. Um, next is another Barry M product and it's the that's how I roll mascara this uh, purple packaging one um, I really like this I, I do think it really lifts my lashes um, I do still use an eyelash curler before because I have the straightest lashes that don't want to do anything but I think this the wand for this let me just show you the wand is brilliant for both top and bottom lashes you've got the longer side and you've got some shorter bristles 
So it's also brilliant for doing the lower lashes um, without making a mess. Um, it lasts all day, doesn't transfer under my eyes. So yeah, I'm really enjoying that one. And then next, I've, do, I've got to mention Duo Glue. Now, now I've got the hang of how long to leave it before putting it on. Oh my God, my lashes just last so well. It's so easy to kind of peel off the lashes when you take them off as well. Um, I like that a lot. There's not really much else I can say about that. Um, so moving on. The lashes, um, I just have the packet here because I have them on my eyes. These are the lashes from Makeup by Lisa in the style Raven and they are by far my favourite lashes. I absolutely love these. They are so comfortable. I think they're so fluffy, fluttery and they just, they're just beautiful. I love them. Absolutely love them. So a very, very firm favourite there. I do also love the Pixie Lashes, but the Raven ones, by far my favourite. And next is also from Makeup by Lisa. I have a couple more items actually here. And it is this liquid lipstick in the shade Burlesque. This is so comfortable to wear. The pigment is stunning. And it lasted for over eight hours. I had to scrub it off. It, it stays put. This is a good, long-lasting, comfortable liquid lipstick. Really, really impressed. I just, the only thing I want is to see this in more colours. Really, really want to see, I'd love to see a black and a blue and a green. Just that's personal preference, but I would love to see that. And then also there is the Makeup by Lisa highlighter in the shade Pearl. I love this highlighter it's got like violet blue reflex it is just absolutely stunning i'm wearing it in this look also on my inner corner and brow bone it's absolutely stunning with a colorful look or a purpley pinky look it it's just beautiful absolutely beautiful definitely my go-to when i'm doing a more colourful look. Um, and then on to eyeshadow. I couldn't not mention this little one because for three pounds, this is outstanding. Three pounds. And uh, these shades, oh, they're gorgeous. Creates the most beautiful eye look. I do do the same eye look whenever I wear this. However, I love it absolutely love it and I have reached for this quite a few times absolutely stunning but the the pigments there um it lasts on the eyes it doesn't break up but it's just beautiful how you can get such an amazing quality eyeshadow for three pounds is beyond me but I had to mention this one just because it blows me away I love it and finally, I saved the big one for last, the Ace Beauté Oceanic Palette. Oh my god, this, this palette, let me get the mirror out of the way, look at those shades. They are absolutely stunning, all the different shades of blue and green there. They just look so beautiful on the eyes. The shimmers are just stunning. The mattes blend into each other so beautifully. I have had zero issues with this palette. And for anyone that knows me, this colour story is a dream for me. It's uh, my perfect colour story. It is so, so beautiful. I knew I was going to love it before I got it but when I tried the formula I was amazed I'm so in love with this palette and for anyone who likes blues and greens I highly highly recommend this highly beautiful beautiful palette so yeah that's uh 
that's about it for my September favourites. So if you've liked this video and would like to see more like this, then please like it, give me a thumbs up. Um, really helps me out and uh, helps me know what people are enjoying also. So yes, thank you for joining me today. If you are new, then uh, hi. <laughs> um, I hope you'll consider sticking around and subscribing. Um, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss next time I upload. So thank you again for joining me today and I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.